Welcome to my second channel. On my main channel, I have a couple videos where I made infinity cubes. While making them, I used a jig to help me solder the LED strips together. The jig is fairly easy to make, so in this video I'll be showing you how I made it. My first version was kind of rough. I just used a drill bit to kind of carve out part of a wooden block. My next version was much better, so this is the version I'll be showing you how to make. I started out with a square dowel. This one is one and a quarter inches square. I need a wooden cube, so I measure one and a quarter inches from the end and cut it there. This specific size is not required. You just need one that's a good size for you to work with. After the cube is cut and sanded, I measure in three eighths of an inch from one of the corner edges. Then I measure in 3 8 7 inch from the other side of that same corner edge. I repeat this for three of the corner edges where the three edges meet at a corner point. I'm carving away these three corner edges so that I have 45 degree angles at each. The marks that I made show me how far I need to carve to get to the correct angle. If you don't have the Dremel tool that I'm using, you can also do this with sandpaper, a file, a rasp, or anything else that you have that will remove the wood. Once the angle is made, you'll need to carve a groove in the middle of the new side that is wide enough for whatever LED you're using. The LEDs that I'm using are the 50-50 size, which are 5 millimeters wide. You can either measure for this groove, estimate, or occasionally stop and test for the LED strip to get the correct size. I wanna take it on it. I'm falling. The amount of precision that you want is totally up to you. And you can use whatever tools you have available to carve out these grooves. The one that I made for this video, I did as a quick and easy one, while this other one that I made, I spent more time to make it more precise. Both will work, but the less precise one may take a bit more time for adjustments when positioning the LED strips. This is a quick and easy tool to make that helps you position your LED strips at the correct angle for your infinity cube. Leave a comment if you have any questions. Thank you for watching.